Big time handicap match underway here. Oh, what a close line. Forcefully delivered. Oh, nasty impact. Hooked up and backdrop suplex. Ring rattling. We've seen handicap matches throughout WWE history that can display someone's incredible ability. And we've seen the handicap match be utilized to deliberately put someone in less than advantageous situation. Either way, handicap matches are something that a superstar must be ready for. No and a pin attempt. And Lesnar powers out. Too early in the match to end it. No matter what era of WWE history we look at, or if we're talking about present day, the handicap match can be going for the cover. And a speedy kick out by Brock Lesnar. That's all right, Cole. What a stomp. Good grief. How could Brock Lesnar just dig deeper right now and find his way out of this one? He needs to find a way to get on the offensive, guys. He's not looking like himself right now, and I hate to say it, but this might be the beginning of the end for him here. Down to the floor. in section 112. Oh boy, he is rolling. Back now inside the ring. Looking for the finish. I don't think he should get up. He's making a statement here with this attack. Brock Lesnar is in a world of hurt. This might just be the end of the road for him here in this handicap match. If he finds a way to rebound from this and oh. actually win this handicap match, I will be absolutely shocked. I think I can safely speak for all of us when I say that this beating he's taking is pretty tough to watch. What a strike. Oh, what a backbreaker. Man, just ugly impact. A handicap match is the type of match where a superstar or superstars square off against respective opponents, and one side has a numerical advantage against the other. This could be a singles match or a tag team match, and as we've seen through history, can include any amount of superstar. Here we go. Blood mass. Golly. Game set. Shoulders on the mat. Gets the shoulder up. Wow. What's it going to take? How'd he do that? Handicap matches have been part of the WWE for decades. The superstar has seen the most handicap matches out of anyone is the iconic eighth wonder of the world, Andre. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his salt ever does. Oh boy, he is worth him. Bonnie dodges out of the way. Vicious feet. Knocked off his feet. Now that's a takedown. Them. Throughout WWE's more than 54-year history. Oh, he kicked out. Unbelievable. I'm just as shocked as everyone else, Cole. There he goes, crashing to the floor. That night on Raw, Roman Reigns was determined to take down Anderson and Gallows. What I found more impressive than taking Anderson and Gallows on was that Reigns did so right before he squared off against Braun Strowman in Fastlane. The big dog never rests. Roman Reigns is happy to take on anyone who thinks the WWE ring is their yard. 
Look, I'll never dismiss the power, determination, and ability of Roman Reigns. I've been in the ring with the man. The match ended because Roman took it upon himself to attack Anderson and Gallows with a steel chair. With a harsh impact, Lesnar back in firm control of this match. Here's the cover. Nailed it. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Oh, oh, my goodness, crushing it. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Not the oh, 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 my goodness, crushing it. He might have it. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. He's looking banged up here, guys. And it looks like things are about to get even worse. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Here he goes. Boom, what impact. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? Ali, up. When this guy's on, look out. He's good tonight. Good grief. Wow, I, I gotta say that I'm in shock. I really thought Lesnar would look better here tonight. Brock Lesnar is in a real bad spot here. Dodges that one. This might be it. Oh, my. Brock Lesnar just too fast for him. Lightning speed from the beast. Controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Here he goes. Boom! <laughs> wow, I, I gotta say that I'm in shock. I really thought Lesnar would look better here tonight. Brock Lesnar is in a real bad spot here. He wants no part of the outside. Inside the ring now. This could be it. This might not have been a wise move for him here, Michael. How did he do that? I don't know, Michael, but I think. I don't think he could have taken much more of that. Here we go. Good night. Good grief. That's what he was looking for, Michael. I think we know what this is. He looks to be losing a bit of leverage here. He forces his way free. Man, he just has so much resolve. He's looking at it. Beautiful technique. That's how you put an exclamation. Got the shoulders down. What is keeping this competitor going? Not yet. Oh my goodness, this hurts. He goes for the cover. I don't know too many other guys that would have been able to kick out of that. Wow. That's pure power, guys. We've seen handicap matches throughout WWE history that can display some... He might have... Ooh, what impact. Wow. I gotta say that I'm in shock. I really thought Les... His shoulders are down. And he manages to get the shoulder up. He's still in this. A striking blow. No matter what era of WWE history we look at, or if we're talking about present day, the handicap match can be dangerous for all competitors evolved. And if you're a superstar who's outnumbered, you have to be extra careful about ending up on the losing end of things. A beating could stop and never end depending on how the odds shake out. That's very true, Michael. With that being said, though, just because a superstar is on the side that has the numbers advantage, history's also shown us that it's important to stay focused on the mission at hand and take care of business rather than to get cocky because you have more people on your side of the ring. Bringing it back into the ring. 
And he's heading back in. He's not looking like himself here. But we all know that he isn't afraid of a good fight, which is what we're seeing here. He's going for the pin. And he got a near fall out of it. How'd he do that when Brock is feeling it? Good luck to you. Knee as a weapon. What a strike. Right on the mark. Oh boy, he is rolling. Good night. Good grief. Here's his moment, Michael. In 2017, the WWE Universe saw the immeasurable power of Braun Strowman unleashed in handicap matches. The monster among men annihilated teams of two, three, and four men in the end may be near. Brock Lesnar just too fast for him. Lightning speed from the beast. Going for it all here. He lets it go. Yeah, I wonder why. He's definitely starting to lose it here. Boy, I remember when we called the action that night on Raw and Braun Strowman was simply unstoppable. The easiest way to put it is that Braun Strowman doesn't care if he's in the ring against local competitors or WWE superstars because Braun Strowman just wants to tear people apart. There aren't many individuals who are just as dominant in handicap matches as they are in traditional singles matchups. What we saw in that match from Braun Strowman was almost like witnessing a massacre right in front of us. Watch Brock Lesnar put it together here! Oh boy! Is he done? Throughout WWE's more than 54-year history, there's one superstar who... He broke out of it. Oh, how in the world did he find the energy to do that? Oh boy, he is rolling! Just a step quicker, it looks like. That night on Raw, Roman Reigns was determined to take down Anderson and Gallows. What I found more impressive than taking Anderson and Gallows on was that Reigns did so right before he squared off against Braun Strowman in Fastlane. The big dog never rests. Roman Reigns is happy to take on anyone who thinks the WWE ring is their yard. Look, I'll never dismiss the power, determination, and ability of Roman Reigns. I've been in the ring with the man. The match ended because Roman took it upon himself to attack Anderson and Gallows with a steel chair, which in my mind was done without just cause. And it's something I don't condone. When this guy's on, look out. Long distance drop. He wants no part of the outside. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Here he goes. Wow, well, I gotta say that I'm in shock. I really thought Lesnar would... There's the cover, can he do it? This handicap match is over. Now let's look back at that amazing action. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. Hope everybody at home set those DVRs because that was a match you're going to want to watch again and again and again. Epic. Here are your winners. Chuck North. Bruce the Dragon Lee. Quite some back and forth there before finally picking up the win. Wow, I can't believe the amount of punishment that had to be inflicted in order for those shoulders to stay down for the three count. Don't adjust your TV, folks. This Vegas crowd really is this loud.